Uh, Tom Brady's going to be the butt of a roast in what they're calling the greatest roast of all time. Variety has learned exclusively. Variety learned this exclusively. Nice. Wow. Wow. Hey, Variety, whenever they put their nose down and try to, you know, hunt scoops, they do. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Variety has learned exclusively that the iconic NFL quarterback is set to be the first subject of what will be a planned series of new Netflix comedy specials called The Greatest Roast of All Time or Groats. Now, for people that have been fans of this show for a long time. Yeah. Mm Mm-hmm. They understand that we have already had a groat. That's mm-hmm. right. The greatest raffle of all time, mm-hmm. I do believe. Mm-hmm. Well, you bought the um, baseball, the baseball, doc- baseball, the baseball yeah. documentary. Oh, You're yeah. automatically entered into a raffle to win like World Series tickets, Super Bowl tickets, a Lisa mattress at the mm-hmm. time, mm-hmm. like 50 things. We called it the greatest raffle of all time. The groat. It was a great name. It was. We enjoyed our time with it. Yeah. yeah. Now Tom Brady and Netflix are taking the growth. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Good luck, Tom. To quote my good friend Marshawn Lynch, Tom Brady said, I'm just here so I won't get fined. Brady will serve as an executive producer on his own and future roasts. His roast will be filmed in 2023 following his next season. Right with, around the corner. Can't wait. Yeah, but they didn't say his final season there, right? True. That's that's a little bit of an interesting thing Variety mm-hmm. learned. And did Variety ask? Did, they, did Variety say, hey, is this your final season? Is this what your future looks like? Are you doing this after this season? Because you know this is kind of the swan song of your thing before you focus on the groat in other uh, situations. We can't wait to burn three-time Super Bowl losing quarterback Tom Brady, <laughs> who only went back to the NFL in order to delay this roast, said Robbie Praw, oh. Netflix's vice president of stand-up and comedy formats. In all seriousness, so okay jokes aside it's a huge thrill to work with the greatest football player of all time on this project no one's better at taking hits and still coming out on top so we know the roast will be a breeze for brady wow this is good. congrats Tom. Yeah, Tom. 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 So, so what's that it's so that statement hit everything yeah, are we sure that's the VP of stand-up comedy or like the head of all stand-up comedy? Or is he guy's... like the dad of comedy? Yeah, the fa- like, yeah, he created stand-up comedy. Yeah, I maybe? think so. Maybe so that guy's fucking hilarious. Listen, if wait. Jeff Ross, the roast master, ain't a part of this, I'm fucking out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I can't yeah. wait for it to see yeah. how good fucking Gronk is up there. That'll be fucking sweet. Yeah. Uh, that will be what sweet. Is that? Bro, Gronk will definitely this. be up there. Gronk yeah, will definitely be there. Deliver some. The question bangers. is though, Gems. they need to have the right. Comedians that are absolutely ruthless to make this good. Need the White Tiger. Need the yep. White Tiger. Yeah. He has yes. a Netflix deal, right? Yeah. Need Chappelle. He has a Netflix need, deal. Uh, mm-hmm. You know who they need? Uh, Anthony Jeselnik, too. Yes. I don't know if you know anything uh, about him. He's from Pittsburgh. I yes. know who Jeselnik yeah. is. Segura. Uh, Anthony Jeselnik. Bring in Segura. Uh, Jeff Ross needs to be there, honestly, yeah. Yeah. because that's his whole thing is he's a roast master. And a lot yeah. of people probably assume, like, oh, this guy, what a loser. I am massive fan of Jeff. Oh Rose. yeah, but does he do his stuff on Netflix though, or is his all Comedy Central and other? Places? I think he's independent right now. I, I think he yeah. probably can get yeah. brought in. I hope so. I hope he can get brought in as a hired gun. Fucking need that guy yeah. on the dais for sure. Nick Kroll. Nick Kroll has a Netflix deal, and he was dynamite at Seth Rogen's roast. So if they have good brains on this, it could be absolutely mm-hmm. fantastic, and they'll probably hire writers, roast writers as well, for sure. into this oh, yeah. thing. It's going to be great. I think it's going to be great. Oh, Why are you so maybe negative? Maybe they'll bring in Amy Schumer. That Ooh, would be good sweet. idea. Maybe. Amy will obviously do a burial of everybody on the dais and also probably receive some on the way back, which is what those roasts always become. Yeah. yeah. Whitney, Whitney Cummins is on a lot of them. She'd be good. Okay. Mm-hmm. Does she have a Netflix deal? Uh, she has Netflix specials, I know. Okay. Well, so there we go. go. This might be the greatest Sebastian. roast of all time. Hey, this yeah. might be the growth. You hear me? Yeah, I can't wait 18 months from now to see it. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be sick, dude. It won't I'm happen, just, but in front of it. seeing Peyton just eviscerate him. Oh, like, he will. Oh. See, what are you it will happen. That will be Please Belichick. have Peyton. You think? Oh. Get Bill in there. Come on. So the only issue is if you go up to be a roaster, you're also about to get roasted mm-hmm. for the next four hours as well because mm-hmm. you're sitting up there. Right. So, like, will Bill Belichick sit up there for four hours mm-hmm. while no. some of the greatest comedy minds on earth get a chance just to fucking he could come out it'd be perfect though he could just come out at some point surprise guest obviously as a comedian write all this stuff for him he does like a quick three to five minutes and then he walks right off yeah matt patricia probably write his stuff yeah (laughs) matt patricia probably write his stuff maybe joe judge who knows i mean mcdaniel should definitely be there but what if bill just walked up and was like you suck and then walked off and that was it that would be sweet it was because of me (laughs) and then just and then just left didn't even sit back down just left 
Ernie's been ghostwriting for Bill for a long time. He might as well. No, he's not. Up. I saw the schedule release thing. We need not have Ernie at this. <laughs> what? <laughs> Ernie crushed your schedule oh, release. Easter Beast coming. We know Easter Beast will be there. Oh. oh! He actually does have comedy jobs. I don't know if there's Jesus Christ in the building or not, but I do know there's some football royalty. <laughs> <laughs> One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish, whoever knew fish fucking Jack did. Remember her Tom when he found the Lord? <laughs> Randy Moss. Definitely. He'll be the horse, there. The horseman or the receiver? Okay, Saber, listen, I, I, would like to let, I would like to let you know, and I'm sorry, horse community, go back into your barns with your pissed offness if I say this. Don't fucking ever confuse Randy fucking Moss, okay? Randy fucking Moss with whoever the fuck you just said. Please, don't ever do that again, okay? I don't I, ever, I never do that. You just, you just did. What are you talking about? No, you, I didn't get him mixed up. I was wondering if maybe you could have both of them, or maybe you have same the horseman sentence, Randy Don't Moss do it. there, too. Don't do it. Don't do the same okay. sentence thing, okay? Now I know. Now I know. Sorry. Thank you for making me aware. I just I, I just got unreasonably upset with you right there. I know. This I is know. Randy Moss yeah. we're talking about. Don't do it. Don't do that with the horse. The fucking horse. Who's Randy Moss the horseman? No fucking idea. I only know one Randy Moss. And another name just popped in, though. Vrabel. Oh, definitely yes. Be there. Vrabel had four pack in. Mm-hmm. Who's Randy Moss, the horseman? This guy killed a guy on a horse or he's something? Like an ESPN no, he's an guy. No, he's an ESPN yeah. reporter. He's, an he's like doing derby time every year. Horse, horse racing analyst. analyst. No he's offense. Good. He's no, very good. no offense to Randy Moss, the horse analyst. But in my eyes and a lot of people other eyes, he should have changed his name. Out of respect for fucking Randy Moss. Yeah. Please. I think he goes Maybe. by Randall Moss. He's no, a little he's older, not, though, no, so I think he not. was already established when Randy Moss started making plays, probably. Well, sorry about it, Randall. Randy ah, caught up pretty quick. Loser. Yeah.